Hi, it's a really hot and really sunny day here in Toronto, and I'm here at the Toronto Comic Book Show. And uh, this is the show we always look forward to. I'm here with Jay Man. I'm going to meet him uh, in just a sec. And um, it's uh, this is the June version. I think there's a fall one as well, and I think a winter one uh, closer to Christmas. Uh, but usually I get a lot of uh, fun stuff here. So uh, hopefully I can take some footage inside. If not, I'll see you on the other side. Okay, it's 10.01, so you can go right in. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, that's going to be bad. They got buying something. Morning. How are you doing? Yeah, but mine's in the morning. Mine's a flying bus. Flying a very flying bus. This is like the higher end stuff. I just got back from the uh, Toronto comic book show um, with J-Man and um, I didn't bring a lot of money this time. Um, I'm on a budget and also I just had some few pin pinpoint things I was uh, looking for. Uh, but this, is, this was an awesome show. Great selection. Um, more than one table had big little books. Uh, I didn't get any but like I was impressed by that. Um, a lot of... Um, old like golden age and silver age um lots of bronze age lots of complete sets um this show is always pure comic books um no no toys and all that crap um and uh there are key bins but there are a lot of bins with just like random stuff in it and um and the people seem to understand what people are looking for um uh they bring stuff off the beaten path um usually which you'll, you'll see when you see what I got. Um, so, uh, let's take a look at what I uh, got. Let me. All right. So, I'm trying to fill up my Advanced Dungeons and Dragons um, 
collection. So I got um, issue 16. And these are the TSR comics uh, that DC put out in the 80s. Um, I got issue 6. Issue 3. And I'm trying to um, fill my uh, my Lexor uh, collection. So uh, the series of stories in Pre-Crisis Superman where uh, Lex Luthor had his own planet and, and um, taught everyone that Superman was the devil and all that stuff. Um, I love all those stories. So I'm trying to get all the issues that have Lexor stories in them. So I got Superman 235. And all the prices you see on these are haggled down. That's the great thing about this um um this show as well that you get like big discounts and stuff so um so uh you got a neil adams cover here um superman uh 232 and action comics uh 335 and these have some great classic um covers as well so um so yeah, I'm I'm trying to just slowly, a little bit by a little bit, I'm getting all the uh, Lexor uh, story comics. Also, I got a bunch of Savage Sword of Conan's trying to whittle down that collection. Not too many. So I got um, issue 80. Love these covers, by the way. Listen, the, the one of the best things about Savage Sword of Conan are the covers, but also the stories are awesome. Um, they're badass. Uh, here's uh, 85. This completes my 80s, <laughs> at least. And I got some key ones. So I got number three. There you go. It's got some notes on it. You know, uh, Neil Adams, Barry Windsor Smith. Um, there might be some damage here, but like uh, this is a pretty good, um, uh, pretty good condition one. Uh, all new, two Titanic tales. The greatest fantasy ever. Um, and issue two. So the earlier issues I find in my market are, are getting harder and harder to find. Um, so this is great. Um, these earlier ones are getting more and more expensive um, as we uh, move um, ever forward uh, away from the 70s when these comics were big. Um, the later issues are still like five bucks and stuff like that, but... Um, I'm trying to pick off the big boys right now, so. And also, I'm trying to complete my, um, Marvel Legends retro run. So, um, I don't have Black Widow, so I picked her up. It says 10 bucks. I'm going to try and carefully take that off. If I can't, then this will be my loose one, and I'll try and get a, um, like a sealed one. Um, I'm still missing three more characters, and then I'm good for this, uh, series. So that's what I got. This comic show is a pretty good damn show. Um, there's usually one um, in the fall or so, so I'll check that one out too. Anyways, till next time, take care.